we going? What was it again? Hong Kong. Oh, Hong Kong. On the ferry. Oh, I thought you wanted me to say the same. We're on the ferry from Guangzhou to Hong Kong and it's going to take us about two hours. Right now we're going to surprise Dao, our head coach and school leader, with a gift that all of us have signed for him. Collectively, as a school, from our deepest heart, thank you for this profound transformational experience and that may Shaolin be a living, active tradition in our everyday life going awesome. to the Dow. Awesome. Henceforth, uh -oh. on behalf of Team Canada, <laughs> All right. no way. we thank you That's awesome. for the experience. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I hope you all had a good time and uh, you know it's, it's been an amazing journey. Uh, but you know the greatest thing is that this part of the journey now is actually very relaxing. You've got a lot of free time. So take the time to enjoy Hong Kong uh, and just even just relax. There's so many things to do and see. You hang out with your friends. Just do what you like. And uh, well, we get back to Canada, Toronto, and uh, hopefully you see everybody train even harder. Yeah. Okay, because our school not only is it growing, but with this kind of international experience that we now have, and then what you are seeing other people, imagine what we can do if everyone pushes their training a little bit more in two years from now. And hope that everybody will consider joining us again. Okay, thank you everybody. Right. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Ending off this trip in Hong Kong was really great. We got to tour the city. We ended up spending Halloween in Hong Kong. That was a real adventure. We ate at uh, different restaurants, uh, even Italian restaurants that had Kung Fu pictures all over the walls. And I got to connect with a bunch of guys that I went to high school with who were all from Hong Kong. And we hadn't seen each other in probably about 35 years, so that was an amazing thing to uh, have a connection with, uh, with my old buddies. in Hong Kong and we're flying out today in the afternoon so we're leaving the hotel about 11.30 on the bus. So this is my last chance to practice or train any martial arts in Asia. Um, so I'm out of the park here in Kowloon or Kings Park and I'm going to do the uh, last little bit which will be some Qigong and a couple of uh, forms that I've been training here.
dos, tres, ¡Ello! Well, it's time to head home. We're going to fly back to Canada now. It's hard to put into words what this whole experience was like. Dow, our team leader and coach and founder of our school, he really pulled together a diverse group of Canadians and brought us all to a faraway land. This was a big journey in both getting ready to compete and flying all the way to China to compete and it was a really rewarding experience, I think, for all the competitors to really push ourselves, uh, both in the preparation and in just getting out there, getting out on stage, um, on the floor to compete in front of the world. The experience was incredible. Um, not only the competition, but all the touring around China that we did as well. And we can't have a wrap up without our favorite fan guy. Now we're heading home. We brought some medals. Our team has grown. We've supported each other through the highs and lows of the competition. And I think, I think that there's a really bright future for Shaolin Team Canada and many more tournaments in China to come.